A chat with the mayor. Our newest bright side anchor, Frank Wiley, has spent the last week getting to see all our area has to offer. He recently had the chance to sit down with St. Pete Mayor Rick Christman to chat all things St. Pete. A view from the top. St. Petersburg Mayor Rick Kreisman says he's pushed the last 12 months of his plans through a life-changing barrier. Does this feel natural now? Uh, I mean, honestly, no. I, I, don't, I don't know that wearing a mask is something that will ever feel natural. He's done a lot in his eight years as mayor, pushing for the St. Pete Pier. We're going to have a pier. We are going to build a pier. And that he did. The St. Pete Pier was recently voted the number two best new attraction in the nation for 2020. An opening that happened much differently due to the COVID-19 pandemic. The mayor says the pandemic exposed the city's weaknesses as much as it did strengths, saying that there's still racism out there, but more people are willing to talk about it, to change it. Trying to create equity and equality. The root, he believes, of his city's success. When I came in this, into office, the city didn't have a vision statement of who and what we wanted to be. He wanted to build a community that embraced people. We're not there yet. And their experiences. Your race shouldn't matter, your gender shouldn't matter, your religion shouldn't matter, your orientation, who you love, your economic status, none of that should matter. Kreisman recently gave his final State of the City address, citing the city's 2050 plan as a sign of the city's commitment to equality. This era of progressivism and participation and inclusion in St. Pete has helped to shape and elevate our city and our people. 